love story is not your typical love story. Mm. Dare I say, um, you've known each other a really long time. So, like, mm. a, tell me how you met. So, we met at what is perhaps uh, the most awkward gathering place for teenagers, uh, which is band camp. <laughs> you, met, you met at band camp? We met yeah. okay. at, yeah. at band camp when we were about 13, 14 yes. years old. Youngsters. And about three years later, um, I was on the one train in New York City. It was my first week in the pre-college program at Juilliard. And I was with my friend, and we see this young man who was sitting there who was singing to himself and playing air piano. Oh, and I looked at him goodness. and I was like, I know that guy. That's John Batiste from New Orleans. And then I blurted out in the way that 16 year olds do, uh, that's the man I'm going to marry oh. someday. Oh my gosh. You John, did you, did you hear her say that? No. No, no. no. I didn't hear anything. Um, <laughs> Music in my head. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Right. And we completely forgot about it, and you know we stayed friends. And it took about a decade later mm -hmm. wow. for us to yes. actually get together. So um, you had a real foundational relationship. Oh yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. My gosh, yes. John, was there a moment for you when you knew that Suleika was the one? Oh my goodness, she stood out from the band camp days. <laughs> <laughs> But you know that it's it's all about timing. When you find that right person, just mm. trust the process, y'all. Mm. Trust the process. Don't don't force it. Just live life and be be happy with yourself and keep developing. And friendship is also important. We had a great friendship. Mm. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Great friendship.